Wichita City Council also approved a sound study to determine how loud the planned South Lakes pickleball complex will be. KSN Zena Taher explains how the city plans to cut down on noise from the pickleball court. Zena. Jeff, I talked to neighbors and pickleball players about the new complex. Everyone I spoke with seemed excited about the build, which would be the biggest city-built pickleball complex complex in Wichita. The city tells me sound studies are standard procedure before a breaking ground on big projects. The sound of the plastic ball connecting with a paddle. It's music to our ears. So like I love the sound of it. Whenever I hear it, I'm like, ooh, pickleball. The hollow tap could turn into a nuisance for people living across from the lot where the pickleball complex is being built. There's already significant sound there from the soccer play and, and the, throughout the United States at a lot of the different pickleball facilities, they talk about the noise that it makes. Living in this neighborhood for 20 years, Don Bohannon isn't concerned about the additional noise. We've had soccer over there. It's like anything else. You get used to the sounds after a while. You just don't notice them. Building a berm is one alternative the city council discussed to block noise out. We also talked about maybe we need to relocate some of the courts, so we really won't know until we get that sound study back. Players believe adding more courts will create opportunities for connection. I always recommend, like, if somebody's moving to a new city, like, just to go try pickleball, because, like, then they'll have instant friends. Becoming an asset to the community. Great third. And not a burden. The facility is set to have 18 pickleball courts. It'll be large enough to host tournaments. Here for you, Zena Taher, KSN News 3.